Hi pumpkin heads, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to talk about my favorite horror games. Um, some I have played, some I haven't. Um, because I created a um poll on my YouTube community tab of what videos y'all would like to see, and my favorite horror games got 37 votes, so that's the video I'm going to do. But before we get into that, I have my plush of Bindi with me um, for this. Um, also, I did take my hair down, comb it out, and washed it and straightened it and trimmed my bangs. Um, and also, and also shaved... And then if you can see, I also shaved both sides of my head because I think it looks cool. Um, I want to give a shout out to Jordan. Um, I will try to shout out other people um, at the end of the video. But let's get started with my favorite horror games. Some I have played, some I haven't. Um, my One of my favorite horror games I have played is Five Nights at Freddy's. Um, it was basically the demo version I had um, downloaded on my phone and I played it. Um, I think it was really fun that because I'm a big fan of Five Nights at Freddy's. And also, it's, it's kind of creepy. Um, Especially the jump scares with the animatronics when you're least expecting it. Uh, it's pretty creepy, but I do enjoy it. Um, my other favorite game is um, uh, Bendy and the Ink Machine, of course. My boyfriend had downloaded or bought the uh, version of it. I believe it was for the PS4 or PS5. And um, I believe it was for the PS4. And... I did play it. I couldn't really figure out what to uh, what to do and how to play it, so I was getting kind of frustrated. But I have not played it all the way through. But um, I gotta say, it's a pretty good. It's a pretty good game. It's creepy, and I do enjoy it. I do enjoy uh, scary games. Um, my bangs are annoying me. Um. My other favorite game, um, I have not played. I saw, like, um, a gameplay of it on YouTube, and it is, uh, Poppy's Playtime. Uh, the game is really creepy, um, first off. Um, it kind of reminds me a bit of, um, Five Nights at Freddy's and Bimby and the Ink Machine. Um, but, um, then it gets a lot scarier. Um, I want to play that game, of course. <laughs> um, it looks like so much fun. Um, also I really want to get the, um, uh, it's like this plush doll of a uh, Huggy Wuggy. And it's like the Two-Face one where... Uh, you have like the normal face of him and then you and then you twist the head around and then you have like the really creepy like scary face. I really want to get that uh, for my birthday, but I really don't know when. My birthday is coming up very soon, so I'm gonna I'm gonna have fun. I'm gonna um, order Domino's pizza and probably uh getting intoxicated on my birthday because I mean I'm turning 30 and I just want to have fun so yeah expect I will try to do a video on my birthday on March 17th well the 17th of this month and uh yeah I'll probably be like really intoxicated but it'll be fine some a lot of my videos I have been but Anyway, my other favorite, um, game 
is probably Slender Man. Um, now, I am really weird and a uh, stupid fact about me. I am actually scared of Slender Man. Um, I know it's a creepypasta, but I'm scared of Slender Man. Um, I know he's just a fictional character for, for the story that somebody made up, but I actually believe in it. So, I'm actually scared of Slender Man, but I played the game and on my phone, and it is creepy. Um, my other favorite game is um, Friday the 13th. Uh, I did play that on the PS4. Uh, it is actually a really good game. Um, I actually enjoyed it. I uh, played as Jason. I would play as Jason and uh, just chase around the um, uh, counselors and stuff, um, which I'm not really good at the game, but I do enjoy it. Um, what is the other one? Uh, Evil Dead, I think it's called. I think the game, the other game is Evil Dead. That had come out uh, not too long ago. Um, I did play that, and I'm not good at it. I can't figure it out that well. And it is kind of boring, really, but, uh, I do enjoy it. Um, I think there is a Silent Hill game coming out, or it probably already has. I don't really keep up with when video games come out. Um, my last, last favorite video game is actually for the uh it's actually for the uh ps4 vr one and that is a uh, rush of blood it's actually a lot of fun it is scary um i hate jump scares but uh it was fun i would always play it because my boyfriend had a uh has a uh vr headset and all and I would, um, always want to play that. Um, if some of you have never played the, um, have never played Rush of Blood for the, uh, VR, it, basically, you will be, like, sitting in, it's kind of like a, a roller coaster thing. I'm scared of roller coasters. I have been on a roller coaster twice, never again. Uh. Because I have bad anxiety and panic attacks, so. Um, but in the game, you'll be sitting in, in, in like a, um, like a roller coaster, like a cart, like on a roller coaster. And you have like these, you know, and you have like a bunch of different, um, things you can, um, like shoot at to hit the targets. And you have, like, these, like, scary clowns and freaky, creepy stuff. And there's a lot of, quite a few jump scares that is really creepy. Um, but I really do enjoy Rush of Blood. Great VR game. Um, also there is another game I'm thinking of. Resident Evil, I have played that. Um... I played that, it was back in March of 2017, um, I had, I think it was no, I think it was like 2016, I don't remember, no, 2017, um, me and my boyfriend and his, uh, friend, uh, we, from, his friend from high school, uh, we had went to, uh, AniCon, which is an anime convention, because my boyfriend loves anime, and, I mean, I'm not a big, big fan of anime, but there are some animes I do like. Uh, but after we had got back from the anime convention and got back to my boyfriend's, the apartment he was at, um, his, uh, friend who went, who we, uh, met there, who had got there and we met outside, um, had a VR um, so we, uh, he brought it over to my boyfriend's apartment, and we were, I played the game first, 
and it was like i believe the demo version and you had like these like it, i i don't really know how to explain it but it, it it's scary and uh i did scream i screamed as loud as i could because it scared the living heck out of me as the first time i ever played vr um it was it was a lot of fun i I would actually like to play it again. Um, also, that was also the that was also the uh, same day when I had got the flu because I think one of the co I think when I was taking my picture with one of the cosplayers at the anime convention, I think that one of them had the flu had had was sick and. I got the flu and was miserable, but I survived, of course. Um, I really can't think of any other games. Um, I mean, I have played the Ghostbusters game, of course. I'm wearing my shirt. It's not, like, scary, but I do love Ghostbusters. And my boyfriend got me this shirt for Christmas one year. And it says, I ain't afraid of, of ghosts, or I ain't afraid of no ghosts. And, yeah. I'm also really excited for the uh, new Ghostbusters movie. So, yeah. Um, it is like 12 something at night right now, and I should be in bed asleep. I'm probably going to get ready and go to bed anyway. Um, also, if you hear any noise in the background, that is actually my brother. He's on the phone with one of his friends. So, uh, yeah. But, um, I hope you guys enjoy my videos. I am so excited. I'm so excited that I am at 758 subscribers. Um, I know that's not a lot, but it means a lot to me because I never thought that, um, I would get that far. Um, so thank you everyone. Um, but if I do, <laughs> but anyway, um, my birthday is going, is on the 17th of this month. Um, uh, like I said, I'm going to order pizza. We're going to order pizza from Domino's. Excuse me. Um, going to order pizza from Domino's and, um, probably have a cake or whatever. And, uh, probably go to Edward McKay for my birthday, because I want to. Um, and probably, like I said, I'll probably, uh, get in, probably drink and get intoxicated, because, I mean, I don't do that, like, every day. Um... But I, I want to uh, get intoxicated and do that for my uh, birthday because, I mean, I am going to be 30. I'm old enough to do it, uh, even though it's bad. It's very bad for you and bad for your health, but I want to do it. Um, that, um, I, I know uh, YouTube doesn't allow this word, but probably going to smoke you know what yes i do do that and i know it's not good but i i do do that so that, that's it but yeah um i do want to give out some shout outs to like i did in the beginning uh want to shout out jordan uh my my big bro chris um i have like two different subscribers uh uh Dame Chris, uh, I don't really know if, uh, they're subscribed to my channel, but they watch my videos, uh, Chris, uh, my other subscriber, Chris, I love you, big bro, I love you so much, you're an amazing big brother, um, Chris Fawcett, I, I love you, you're an amazing friend, and, um, I really hope your uh, dentist appointment uh, goes well. Um, I I know your dentist appointment will go well. Um, 
because you're, you're going to have Megan and, and them with you, so, yeah. Um, I love you. Um, Frank Cotton, I love your videos. Uh, this guy named Jay, I'm sorry I cannot remember your last name or pronounce it that well like I did in my other videos, so I'm sorry. Um, but I love you. Um, Hard It Up, uh, Stucky and Bud, uh... Wally B twenty six. Um uh Blue Twinkies are good. Um I met some of them from watching um Style of Moth's video that what his live videos when he goes live about Cyrax. Uh I might do another video on Cyrax. So yeah. Um, but there are so many of you that I cannot, um, shout out. There's so many. Um, but, um, that into all of the, that into the haters that watch my videos, uh, I love my, I love, I love my haters too. Because if it wasn't for you haters, um, to my haters, um, that have watched my videos and leave nasty comments your comment one your comments don't bother me but but i do appreciate my the uh negative nancy's who watch my videos um if it wasn't for y'all uh my videos wouldn't get a lot of views so i thank you i i thank you uh haters because uh, uh you watch my videos and it's given my videos views so but i love you uh haters as well y'all were Y'all are cool. Um, to all of my subscribers, I love every single one of you. Um, I really hope one day to uh, continue to have my channel grow. Um, I appreciate every single one of you. Um, people, people who watch my a lot of people who watch my videos are not subscribed, and that is completely okay. That is up to you. Um, you don't have to watch my video. I mean, you don't have to subscribe to my channel if you don't want to. Um, that's completely up to you. Um, but to but I love everyone who watches my videos. Uh, Y'all are amazing. And um, I hope to see you guys back here next time. Um, also, let me know. Also, let me know if I should... Um, also, I'm sorry. Also, let me know if if you if you like me better when I have my hair up or down. Let me know in the comments. Um, but I'm going to I'm gonna try and um include my um uh Facebook and Instagram link to my uh, Instagram and Facebook in the description of this video. As well, uh, I I do have a Discord, but uh, I do not know how to um, copy the link and, and stuff. I don't know how to do that, but if I did, I would also um, link that. I have to figure that out. But I love every single one of you guys. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for loving and supporting me. You guys are the best. Um, also, I forgot to mention um, Cody... I I love you, Cody. Thank you for the um, Mr. Beast uh, Nerf gun that you sent me. That is very sweet of you. Um, you're a great friend, and I absolutely love you so much. Um, and Casey, I love you as well. You're an amazing person. Um, and I hope you have fun at the uh, horror convention you're going to in October. You're awesome. Um. Uh, but I love every single one of you. Um, and I will see you guys back here next time. As well as Bindi. Um, Bindi, wave bye to everyone. Bye.